Let's get this sports podcast party started, all right? The J Reels Podcast. And I hate to even pile on even more, but the NFL has now officially made for the 2020 Olympics flag football. Flag football. Why not have stickball as a summer Olympic event? Seriously? This is what it's come down to? That even Joe Burrow said the other day how he would be interested to be a part of flag football to represent this country that it would interfere with training camp because the games usually are in the middle or to the latter part of July into August. And obviously training camp begins around the 23rd, 24th of July. So how are NFL players going to be able to just shirk the responsibilities to go play in flag football in a 50-yard field? Seriously? And then not only that, you mean to tell me that there's a flag football team somewhere in Africa? A flag football team somewhere in South America? A flag football team somewhere in Eastern Europe? A flag football team somewhere in the Middle East? A flag football team somewhere in Asia? And yes, you can say, well, Jay Reels, they have four years to build up to that. If they have to build up to that, this shouldn't be an Olympic sport. Are you kidding me? This is why, it's part of the reason why I don't follow the Olympics. And it's one of the many reasons why I am not in the least even interested in watching any of these sports. They have three on three basketball. I guess full court basketball with the FIBA rules isn't enough. You have to have three on three basketball. That's why I said, what's next? Stickball? Wiffle ball? Is that next on the docket? Enough. That's it. I'm washing my hands there. I'm not discussing any more about the Olympics. As the old saying goes, if I was not there for the wedding, I'm not going to be there for the funeral. Yes, I get it that the closing ceremonies are Sunday, and I'm sure there's going to be pomp and circumstance, the city of lights, etc. But guess what? I wasn't there for the opening ceremony, so I'm sure not going to be there for the closing ceremony. And as far as the basketball goes, if the U.S. loses to Serbia, which I believe is today, and if they do lose, I'll have a chance to win a bronze. Big whoop for the U.S., But if they lose today or lose in the final on Sunday, then I may even discuss that on Monday. But if not, my hands are washed.